for joining us tonight. We begin with new details to a story that has a lot of people talking. Yeah, we're finding out what happened to that youth sled hockey team's equipment that went missing when thieves took it off their trailer. An adaptive hockey program for boys and girls with disabilities had all their hockey sleds along with other gear stored in a trailer which was kept in a privately owned parking lot near Memorial Park. Owners discovered missing on Tuesday. Police called the program director today saying the trailer was found on a business property on West Vermaho near 14th Street. The team's sleds and gear found piled up in a shed, but the sleds have been stripped of all steel and aluminum, making them totally unusable. Now the kids will not be able to play when their season starts next month. It was very um, devastating today. And when I when they opened the door, uh, I was I had a moment where I had a hard time maintaining composure, mostly because you see the devastation, and then I realize what it is, what it, the impact it is for our athletes. It, it it's a complete hockey program demolished in a storage shed. By the way, the team's helmets also gone. Tonight, we're waiting for word from police about the criminal side of this investigation and if there are any suspects here. In the meantime, the Tigers hockey team needs new sleds. Yeah, we're told each one costs about $700, and the ones they had were paid for with donations and grant money. And we heard from a lot of you last night on social media about wanting to know more about what you could do to help these kids out. Well, the team is raising money now to buy new sleds before the upcoming season. They've posted a link to their GoFundMe page on their Facebook page. If you'd like to help these young athletes play this year, you can find a link to all of this right now at KOAA.com.